Eamon Holmes said Ruth Langsford gets on my nerves just weeks before divorce bombshell. The couple shocked everyone when they announced they would be calling time on their 14-year marriage back in May, announcing they were in the process of divorcing. Eamon Holmes said his soon-to-be ex-wife Ruth Langsford gets on his nerves in an interview just before their split was announced. Former This Morning presenters Iman and Ruth, both 64, decided to call time on their marriage after 14 years together, much to the shock of fans. A sign that all was not well in the relationship, Eamon said in an interview in May how his wife was a creature of habit, which he finds annoying. Gibi News presenter Iman was discussing his co-host Isabel Webster, joking that the 41-year-old never shuts up when the pair are trying to read the papers before going on air. He told HELO magazine at the time, She and my wife are incredibly alike. They're both creatures of habit, like routine, and do things the same way every day. And they both get on my nerves. Isabel said how she and Ruth would gang up on Iman, saying, She sends me messages while we're on air, saying things like, Tell him his tie's not straight. And when he revealed how Ruth snores, she shot back, Don't get me started on his faults. It started to become apparent something wasn't right with Ruth and Iman's relationship, after the couple hadn't been photographed together for two years. They eventually announced their marriage was over in May, and that they were in the process of divorcing, in a statement nobody saw coming. Ruth has stayed silent about the separation, while taking a break from work, but Iman has returned to GV News, thanking fans for support. He's also reportedly been spending time with Katie Alexander, 42, who is said to have been to his house multiple times, and model Haley Sparks. Speaking to Bella magazine, a source revealed, Ruth is in absolute shock. That there is another woman he's turning to is making her wonder how many more there could be. It all feels never-ending. She's very hurt by it all. It's like he's been living a secret life all this time. She feels let down. Never would she have thought that he could have done this to her and her family. Meanwhile, Ruth's friends are saying if Iman can spend time with new people, then Ruth should too. According to Best Magazine, a source said, Ruth has been completely shocked by it all. She doesn't feel ready, if truth be told, but she has been left reeling after seeing Iman get close to a new woman. She never thought in a million years there would be talk of either of them moving on after just publicly announcing their split, but her friends have said that if Iman is moving on with someone new, then there's no reason why she shouldn't as well. Ruth Langsford undergoes hair makeover ahead of Iman Holmes' tell-all. Ruth, who started using a new technique after her hair got thinner in menopause, is said to be getting ready for her Loose Women return next week where she will address her marriage breakdown. Loose Women star Ruth Langsford underwent a hair makeover with long blonde extensions ahead of her reported tell-all about her separation from Eamon Holmes. Ruth, 64, took to Instagram to show her 1.1 million followers all her secrets to getting her signature voluminous bouncy blonde bob. The TV star beamed into the camera as she showed behind the scenes of her hairdressing appointment, revealing that she installs long extensions to achieve the full hairdo. Alongside her latest Instagram offering, Ruth wrote, Had my extensions renewed. I don't have them for length, just for extra volume after my hair got thinner in the no-pause. These are so tiny I hardly feel them in, but I really notice the difference when I don't. Ruth's followers flock to gush over her new look. You look amazing Ruth. Thank you for being so transparent about having extensions after menopause. It's usually such a taboo. One gushed. Another follower echoed. Ah Ruth you look so happy. Loving the hair. Sweet swoo. Ruth you go girl, looking incredible as always, someone else swooned. While a fourth fan of the Loose Women star commented, Beautiful. I love that you're being honest about using extensions too. Eamon and Ruth were married for 14 years before announcing their relationship was over in May. It has been reported that Ruth is finally feeling ready to discuss the split publicly and is gearing up for a Loose Women return next week where she will open up about the painful breakup. She has been absent from the show since April, 
Before it was revealed she had called, I'm on her marriage to the father of four. Reports suggest she feels like she owes the show's viewers an explanation. A source told the Mail Online that while her return will be incredibly emotional, she is a professional and knows any return will mean she has to address her three-month absence. Ruth knows the viewers are heavily invested in her breakup so she will be addressing her and Iman for the first time on the show, they said. The audience has been there through the highs and the lows of her relationship, she has always been very open and honest, and next week will be no different, she owes it to the viewers to say something. She will be surrounded by the people she's closest to on the show, and then will be drawing a line under it, she has no plans to do a big interview. This will be the one and only time she speaks. E-A-R-L-Y-S-I-G-N-S Eamon Holmes called wife Ruth a creature of habit and said she gets on my nerves just weeks before shock split. Ruth recently said that there was no way back for their marriage. G-U-S-T weeks before their split, Eamon Holmes admitted that Ruth Langsford got on his nerves. The TV presenters stunned fans in May after announcing the breakdown of their 15-year marriage. In an interview before their split, Eamon said that the loose women presenter was a creature of habit. He was discussing his relationship with his GB News co-host Isabel Webster with HELO magazine. The 64-year-old joked that Isabel never shuts up when he tries to read the newspapers before going on air. She and my wife are incredibly alike, they're both creatures of habit, like routine, and do things the same way every day, and they both get on my nerves, he said. Isabel also told the publication that she and Ruth used to gang up on him. She said, she sends me messages while we're on air, saying things like, tell him his tie's not straight, and when he revealed how Ruth snores, she shot back, don't get me started on his faults. Cracks started to appear in Iman and Ruth's relationship after they'd not been photographed together for two years. Ruth had been helping Iman after he was plagued with health problems. He had a double hip replacement in 2016, and back surgery last year left him using a wheelchair. He was pictured recently using a walking frame. Since their split, Ruth, 64, has confided to her friends that there is no way back for the marriage. She and Iman first met in 1997 and were married in 2010. Their son Jack was born in 2002. Iman has three children from a previous marriage. The presenting duo won over millions of fans on ITVs this morning between 2006 and 2021. Iman has since starred on GB News Breakfast Show, thanking viewers for their support after announcing his split. Ruth is yet to break her silence on their split, but is believed to speak about it upon her loose women return. The 64-year-old has been absent from the daytime TV show since April. According to reports, Ruth feels like she owes it to the viewers to address the situation and she thinks the loose women environment is perfect for that. It's thought she won't be doing a full interview about it, but will take the opportunity to touch on it while surrounded by her loose women co-stars. A TV insider told Mail Online, the presenters on Loose Women have a history of opening up about their marriage splits on air, and it's a very supportive environment. Ruth knows the viewers are heavily invested in her breakup, so she will be addressing her and Iman for the first time on the show. The audience has been there through the highs and the lows of her relationship, she has always been very open and honest and next week will be no different, she owes it to the viewers to say something.